Oh, hi, yeah. hi, honey fam. <laughs> hi, guys. Come join our family. Okay, we're going to do the <laughs> intro, buddy. You ready? One, two, two three. three. What's, What's up, guys? We are here with Juice Boy. Guys, it has been officially like, what, 10 days? Too long, way too no, long. No, we love him <laughs> so much. He is the best buddy ever. I'm just kidding. If you guys want to, we did make him an Instagram. I'll pop it up right here. You guys should give the little guy a follow. <laughs> we love him so much, guys. Thank you for all your support on our videos and everything. And it's just been so fun. Life with a dog is incredible. Yeah. Like, I didn't expect it to be this great, but like it is. Like, us three and like our family we have, yeah. with, like the Honey Fam, is like. so blessed. Ah, oh, that's sweet. The best feeling in the world. It is. I don't know why, it just like makes me feel at peace, like my heart. It does. <laughs> it's just like a good feeling and we have so much fun with him and we could go on and on and on. Yeah. If you Anyways, guys saw the title, we're going to be talking about our first time. Let's freaking get, let's just go into let's just it. dive okay. in. Girls, is your man leaving hair all over the bathroom? Guys, do your family jewels need a little more maintenance and grooming? Well, we got a treat for you. Today's video is sponsored by Manscaped. Manscaped. Babe, what are you doing? Uh, get out, what I'm shaving. Why are you shaving on the toilet seat again? Get out. Come on. That is freaking disgusting, Hunter. You need to stop. Leaving hairs on the toilet. How do you know it was even me? He has dark hair too. It could just as well be him. It is not the dog. I have something for you. Come here. Listen here, babe. Oh. I got you an early Christmas present to prevent the hairs. Oh, well, I got <laughs> you the Manscaped Performance for Pinocchio. Whoa! Early Christmas, okay. Your balls will thank you. I I'm thanking you right now. <laughs> All right, babe. We are gonna go through these products now so we have no more accidents. <laughs> Wait, am I a dog? Am I a puppy? No, but the hairs! That's an accident, because that's not going to happen anymore. No, it's not. You're right. All right. First off, we have the Manscaped Lawnmower 4.0. And this you're going to use in the shower, not over the toilet. All right, it's not going to happen again. Guess I'm, what? I promise. Guess what? What? It's waterproof. Ooh. And you know what else? No more swampy balls. No. No, because we have Thank ball, you, Lord. ball deodorant. Oh my, that's a game, game changer. Chef's kiss. Also, ball toner. I didn't even know that was a thing. But your balls are about to be looking juicy. Oh, I like my family jewels now. <laughs> yes, even, even more. You are going to be looking so good this holiday season. We are going to be telling them a story today, right, babe? Story time. Story time. We touched on this story a lot. And it comes up in a lot of our Q&As because it, it is wild. Like <laughs> The first time we ever connected was quite the story. So you know what? We were like, let's just lay it all out on the line. Lay it all out there for you guys to just, we, we're, not, we're honest. Like we're not trying to hide anything from you guys. So we're, we're going to be very, very vulnerable. Today. Yeah, we're just going to be vulnerable and uh, just let you guys really into our relationship. Okay. So I'm going to start us off because I have pretty much most of the memory of what happened in the beginning of this I, night. Okay, whoa, that makes me look bad. I completely remember it. No, but like my side of the story with my mom. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 so like, yeah. So that night, Hunter had a basketball game, okay? And my mom drove to my college town to watch the game with me. Hunter and I weren't like talking really. We weren't dating or anything. We were texting a little bit. A little bit, yeah. Snapchatting, but like yeah. nothing crazy. So we went to watch Hunter, just to like be supportive. Okay, so you actually went to watch me? Yes. Like literally just for me? Yes. That's the only you went to the game? Yes. 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 Yes! Okay, see I didn't really know that. Like it was very early on in our- Like we haven't even met in person yet. Yeah, not, never seen each other in person. No. Just like I've watched him play. That's all like we've seen of each other. The shooting a shot on social media. Exactly. Me. So my mom and I go to the game. Afterwards, we go get our noodles because normally we'd go get dinner together afterwards. And we're sitting there eating our noodles and all of a sudden, a message pops up from Hunter and it says, do you want to come out with me tonight? Shoot my shot. We just got the dub. Yeah. And I was like, oh, we're going out tonight. Yeah. I need, a little, I need a little bitty by my side. My mom and I were freaking out. We were jumping up and down, like so excited. <laughs> and my mom was like, don't finish your food. Like pack it up, like go change, go to your hair and makeup, like go get all cute and go over to Hunter's blah, blah, blah. So I said goodbye to my mom. And also I'm gonna say something right here. If you wanna hear some real tea and real juice, stay till the end of this video. 
Because I'm going to be telling you at the end. Whoa. We're going to be exposing. Should I be scared? A little bit. <laughs> We're going to be exposing a little bit. But you have to wait until the end. So, your girl gets ready, gets her hairs did, gets all beautiful. Done did. And then shows up to Hunter's. Also, do you remember the first time you ever saw me, what you thought? Because yeah, this is his yeah. first time. Okay, okay. So, let me just set the scene for you guys. I invite her over to my house. I'm like sitting there. I got my whole, my, all my teammates, my whole squad with me. We're all in this together. We're like yeah. at my house. They're like pre-gaming. Pre-gaming, right? yeah. And... I, I hear a knock on the door and our our door, like our front door, is glass so I can see through it. So I walk up to it and I'm like, okay, let me just set, so the step into our house is like this high. It's yeah. like a foot up. It's like a step and then you so, walk in the so door. So I'm already like sitting up this much higher than Libby and Libby is like damn near almost <laughs> eye level with me. I'm like, this girl's a gigantic <laughs> He's never seen me before. I'm like, I was not expecting her to be that tall. I know. Like, she was just this really tall, sexy, beautiful, like, blonde girl. You and I was not like, expecting... You literally said, whoa, you're tall. I So I let her in, and I was, like, so caught off guard. And that was literally the first thing that came out of my mouth was... Wow, you're tall. Wow, you're tall. <laughs> I was seriously thrown off by, like... I was actually expecting you to be six feet tall. I know. I was like, it was so funny. dang, but at the same time, I was like, dang, like that's, that's sexy as can be. Oh. You know? Yeah. Uh, you were like really fit and tall, and like I'm really attracted to that. Thanks, babe. But we like hugged and we like kind of like talked for a little bit. And then after we talked for a little bit, he's like, gave me a tour of, <laughs> of their place, right? I was like, oh my gosh, yes, like I'd love a tour. So we went into like the room, he showed me his room, his bathroom, kitchen, blah, blah, blah. And then wait, 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 <laughs> oh, guys, guys. All my guys out there watching, they're like, oh, oh, a tour, really? Like, okay, so let me, this is what it was for. I had to show, I wanted to show around the house, you know, because I'm just being a gentleman, yeah. but like, I had all my teammates there. Like, there was, how many people was there? Probably like eight at that time. Eight at, okay, eight at that time. So, yeah. like, a bunch of people. Not a bunch of people, but there was people there, and yeah. I was like trying to get away so I could it was just me and Libby. Get and to could, like actually meet each other. Yeah, so I could like you know spit some game with her a little bit. <laughs> Guys, also this is Hunter at such a like basketball boy bro jock like. Ah uh, yeah. So different than himself now, so it's so funny like hearing him talk <laughs> like this. It's flashbacks. Nice potato chip. But we're taking a tour. Blah blah blah. We walked downstairs into the basement. They had like an unfinished basement, but it was cool. It had one of their teammates live down there. And I shot my shot. We were just, we were just standing <laughs> down there and it just felt right. And I just went up and kissed you. Yeah, I was kind of, I mean, like I was getting a vibe that you were like about to attack me. Attack you? But like, like attack me in a good way like you were like ready to pounce the hormones you yeah feel like, the you know how you can feel that like sexual tension in yeah. the air with somebody yeah like as soon as we went downstairs and like even before that i immediately got that feeling i was like this girl she tried to like jump me like a freaking well, wild like cat waiting <laughs> for this moment we were talking and i was so into him so i was waiting for this moment for so long <laughs> So I just had to shoot my shot. And she just like comes out, she hits me with like one of these. No, I did? <laughs> it was aggressive. Was it really? Yeah. Oh. It was aggressive, like dang near like Amazing. lip biting. Really? Yeah, you don't remember that? I feel like I wasn't. It wasn't just a. Are you sure? Uh, yes. Yeah. I was confident. No, yes, you were. That's why I was a little bit thrown off because. Whoa. Yeah, you didn't hold back. That surprises me. I didn't remember. It was that. like, she, Libby, like, she's like, I'm setting the scene here. I'm setting the tempo. Damn. Get yes, with girl. it. Yes, girl. But, okay, what happened after that? I think after that, we went upstairs. We pre gamed a little bit. I met your teammates. They were yeah. so nice to me. And then I'm pretty sure we jumped in my car. Yes, because all of us were like drinking and you didn't. No. So yeah, you drove us to the bars. Yes. And we ended up like going out. We were at the bars and things got a little hectic. Yeah, so there's three main bars 
We went to like three or four different three places. Three bars. There's three bars downtown that are like really good. Remember it was like the stirrup one or not stirrup? It was stirrup. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then there was the one next to it that is more like a sports bar. Yeah. And, and then the, down the like road, the there's like one that's just a really illegal place. It was like We did go out another I can, night. I can literally say the exact thing you're wearing. You are wearing your dark gray Lulu's. Lulu joggers Yep. with like a gray tank top. Yep. And then you had your Adidas, like, three-stripe yeah. zip-up hoodie, yeah. and you tied it around your waist. Yeah. Oh. That was, like, over, that was, like, three and a half years ago. Yeah. And I remember the exact so outfit that you showed up to my house in. That is so cute. <laughs> but I remember, like, when we got downtown, we both started drinking. Yeah, we did. We'll give you a little bit of detail about... We've talked about this before, but oh we, get to, we get to we get to one like bar. the third bar. This is the third bar. Yeah. So it, like the the end of the night is like kind of coming. Yeah. And, but the energy is still really high. Yeah. We're and with all his teammates in the bar we went we, to was owned by a teammate. We uncle. yeah. So we had a connection at this bar, and so we're all getting like free drinks. Like they're just flowing, and somehow Libby and I end up behind the bar, like serving other people, which is illegal because we didn't have. I, a I don't know if that's illegal. Oh. But they, but, I mean, I don't think we get in trouble for that no, now. No, you can't. <laughs> but, but, but we're literally back there, like, getting tips shoved in our pants. People like, were throwing money at us. Yes. And somehow Libby ends up laying A on girl asked me if I, she could take a body shot off of me. Oh, my God. What the hell is going on? God. So she's laying on her back on the bar, and she ends up, like, taking shots out of Libby's belly button. And then you did. And then you took one, too. <laughs> And then I got pushed into it somehow. Not even, like obviously I liked it, yeah. <laughs> but like, who expects something like that to happen? And like the craziest part about it, like we haven't even really talked about, or what I think you're gonna say. We'll get to it. Yeah. This. Like, yeah. But for that to be like our first date or first time Just ever meeting, seeing each other, our first time hanging it out. Was Wild. Seeing each other in person. Like, are you kidding me? But then that I think we, we ended up going home. We, I didn't drive. I don't remember who drove. PJ picked us up. Oh yeah, because PJ didn't yeah. drink. It was his friend, teammate guy. So he picks us all up and we go back. And I remember when we got back, we're both a little buzzed. But I had the determination in my brain that I was not going to do anything with you. I wanted to be hard to get. I wanted to be that girl that was... <laughs> <laughs> After she literally... Like started making out with me like the first five minutes of I ever know. seeing me in person. I know. She like tries to then put up this wall and she's like, I'm gonna play hard to get. I'm like, I know. <laughs> I literally shot a shot he was like, go shot is shot. He was like going full force, like for it, you know? And I was like, nope. I wanna wait. This is our first time. <laughs> But obviously, like, I had to respect that. And, oh, you did. And it was like... Oh, we still like... And obviously, it happened, like, it was the yeah. best thing. Because, like, look at us now. Like We still, like, kissed and stuff. Yeah, like, you play it hard to get. And Wait. it made me like you even more. Did I... Did I sleep over? Yeah, you slept ah! over. <laughs> I did! I slept in your bed with you. I know. But we didn't do we're anything. Just, we're just cuddling. Oh, my we're God. We're just cuddling. <laughs> She played hard to get, but she like still, I had to we go. still slept in the same bed and we, we, we just cuddled up. That is so <laughs> funny. But you know what's crazy, guys? After that night, I never left. No. For like... Two years. The rest of like till today. Like three years down the road Literally, now and it's... But like school... We spent like every day He together. went home for summer and that's it. Otherwise, yeah. I spent... And I even slept in his bed when you were gone. When I was gone. I stayed there with his teammate because I worked in our college town. Mind you, Libby had her own dorm room. Dorm room. Oh yeah, <laughs> that was a waste of money. I'm so sorry to my family. I never stayed in it. Not once. After I met you. I wasn't even there and you were just living I in my house. I moved my closet into his closet. Okay, guys, but now this is the juicy part. I really wanted to tell this you. This is kind of. This is exposing Hunter a little bit. Whoa! Okay. Just a bit. You know it is. Like we talked about it that I was gonna say this, and we made sure that we were on the same page with me saying this. Okay. You were okay with it. Go. Go. Oh. Look, all right. Like Libby said earlier, this was during my like 
college basketball days, like jock days, yeah. like a little immature, you know, just how you are in college where like you just like, you know, try to shoot your shot with like every girl possible. No, 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 no. Exactly. It's an athlete thing. I, yeah, I mean, a lot I of guess, guys probably do this in college. Like, people mature, right? Like, I, we yes. go through our ups and downs. I definitely had a lot of growing to do at that point. Yeah. So, I was still in the phase of, like, I'm going to try to talk to a lot of girls. Okay, exactly. So, getting to the point. <laughs> so. Guys, so after that night, I think it was either the next day or the day after that. Yeah. I think the next day was a Sunday, so it would have been Monday, two days later. Yeah, because we were traveling. I was in the bus going to a Norway game. Exactly. I get to my stats class, and there was this girl, we're not going to say names, we're going to call her Jenna. I'm going to go with it, okay? Just a random. Me and Jenna were actually friends, and we like sat next to each other in stats the whole year so far, and I knew she had someone she was talking to, but I didn't know who it was. So, so, okay, fast forwarding. She ends up approaching me in class during an exam, and she's like, go in the hallway. And I was like, okay, well, you know, like, why does she need to talk to me right now? I'm taking a test. Wait, but like, during the exam, like, Libby's sitting there taking a college exam yeah. with a college professor. And this girl. Which is kind of serious, like, very serious. It is. This girl. She was like late to the class, wasn't she, or something? I think I ended up having to take the exam in the second class because I missed the first class for something. Yeah. So she hung around. Hung around after that class to see me. And so she like goes up to the professor and, and is she's like, like, I need to talk I to her. I need this to talk girl. to her like outside right yes. now. Yes. During the exam. I wish I could have seen like what the professor was thinking. And she, I walked out there, right? Like, I didn't know if she had a question, something happened. Like, I was like, okay, yeah, like this girl and I have gotten pretty close in class. So I walk out there and she starts screaming. You taking my man's from me going off at me saying she's going to hit me with her crutch because she had freaking crutches. She's screaming and then she starts crying. And I was like, oh my gosh, what's going on? And then she's like, I've been talking to Hunter, and I heard you hung out with him. And she was so mad at me. Like, think how I felt. I got attacked. So, yeah, I, obviously I didn't know they were in the same class together. And obviously, like, I wasn't trying no, to, like... No, like, he didn't mean for this to I was, Yeah, I wasn't trying for any of that to happen. You don't want to hurt anybody. But like I said, I was in that stage of my life, and I thought I could, like... Get, with get away with some things, but but to my defense, mm -hmm. when I was talking to her, mm -hmm. you I had not met you. Nope. So I didn't know how much you really meant to me and no, how it's important true. We you were so to me. Fast. Because literally, for like that night, like we were together from like then on. Exactly. Literally, like almost every second. We of did every not day. want to be together. We had to be together. Like we yeah. were so happy. So pretty much what happened is <laughs> I was ended a in a huge, explosion. huge fight. Like she screamed at me. I ended up failing the exam because I didn't get to finish it because she just kept screaming at me. And so I ended up calling Hunter after this. Then there obviously was a big blowback on me. I'm literally on the bus, like getting calls from like both of these girls, like absolutely going off on me, telling me how much of a crappy person I am yeah and how much I played them and I wasn't really saying that you played me no you... I just kind of gave him the thing that if you want to stay talking to me you need to call it off with her that's what I told you yeah and I didn't give you much time like I told him he couldn't hang out with me until he broke it off so um Literally the next day, next day I, after his game, yeah. I went in and was like, "This, this, whatever you think this is, like this is not a thing." Because yeah. <laughs> went down. So she actually played a sport too. I'm just gonna like say that. <laughs> yeah. Jenna played a sport, and he ended up like breaking it off and then coming back up to me after his after that, like during the, that was like after your game. And she was there. Yeah. And it was, she had people watching. It was intense. They were like on the lookout for like what my next move was about to be yeah because they knew and they had heard that 
her and him and Libby I. and I had went yeah. out and that we had we were kind of talking now yeah let's just say there was a lot of drama oh and a lot gosh. of headache and that's why we didn't start dating for months later because we didn't want more drama I, yeah I wanted to be like 100% sure like I obviously like I knew like I, I wanted to be with you but you didn't there know. was a lot of people yeah. at that school a lot of athletes like drama filled not to like to my own horn but like Basketball players at that school, oh, for sure. we had a spotlight on us, yeah. and there were people that were out to get you, waiting for you to Mess like, up. slip up. Yeah. Obviously, I did a lot to myself yeah. because of that, but that doesn't mean like people were waiting for me to literally make a mistake. For sure. And they were saying stuff to Libby. Oh my gosh. Like every me. single day, trying to make stuff up about what I was doing, who I was talking to. Like, yeah. People are making this... fake um, Tinder accounts oh trying my to get God. us to break up. They're like, People would be like, oh my god, I they found would, Hunter on Tinder, blah, 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 like he's cheating on you. They would send Libby, like, my t my Tinder profile, apparently, mm -hmm. but funny enough, it was all of my pictures that were on, Twitter. like, Twitter. So they just stole They took Twitter. all my pictures and made a Tinder profile and then sent it to Libby to try to, like, give me in trouble or something. I was going through so they much They tried stress. so hard to, like, break us up. It was... So my emotional well-being was... Oh! pretty messed up like I would yeah. never I couldn't I didn't know if I could trust you for a while no, because everyone tried to make me feel yeah. like I couldn't can I say one more thing that was so funny that you're gonna remember what? do you remember I cut myself at the bar that night and I bled in your bed oh <laughs> okay guys so the following day after Hunter and I hung out that night and I slept over that girl came over for them to talk right were you guys uh, talking like or something like she came over to get her stuff maybe yeah, I think she had to grab something and she, or she, had, somehow, she, had, she had clothes at my house or something Somehow she yeah. found out that you had blood on your bed and she Was pissed and when Libby says cut herself not in like a bad way like she was just like no, she nicked like I arm nicked my on, arm when we were out like at the bar or something. or something and then it was bleeding in his bed when I fell asleep And I didn't know <laughs> so didn't she accuse you of like getting your period she in I my got bed my period in his bed It was so random. I'm like But that's our first time. That was that like, was the tea. That was a lot probably thrown at you. Holy cow! This ended up being a really long video. But it's one of the most entertaining stories we have together in the beginning of our relationship, and I felt like it had to be put out on the internet. It, it, it really had to be. Like, guys, we put our lives out there for you guys to watch and to see, yeah. and to, for us to be in the spotlight. And we've, like, so, said little parts of this story, so we were like, let's just lay it all out. We've always, yeah, we've always hinted at it in, like, previous videos, and yeah. probably some of you guys have, like, caught on a little bit, but don't know the whole, the full story. So this is, like, the juiciest of the juice. Ain't that right, buddy? Ain't that right? He's dreaming. This is like our beginnings. This is where Libby That's and I came from. That's where our relationship started so like, from. When you, I feel like when you have such like a wild, like dramatic, rocky start. Yeah. Like, I feel like we can literally handle anything. It just like, builds I feel like that's why we're foundation. so rock solid. Because, you know, when we, when you go through something like that, mm -hmm. like. Well, we went through we, a lot. We like are so much stronger that we were able to come out and like on top of that, you know? Yeah, baby. Like. I feel just like so good in our relationship. Yeah, just like so confident and rock solid with like where we are, like where we were at then, where we are now, and like where we're gonna be at in the future. <coughs> what? I didn't see that. <laughs> I love you. I love you so much. Guys, we are just so blessed, so lucky we have each other. We have you, we have our new doggo. Like, life is so good. And I just wanna thank you, thank God. Like, Everything's just so many blessings. We're very blessed guys. So also guys stay tuned for vlogmas We're doing that this year, and I'm so excited also and we have some um, Really exciting things coming with maybe a new intro Oh my gosh! Well, yes. like a vlogmas intro yes. with yes. us Boy. three. We are so excited that is being filmed so soon. Yeah, but thank you guys so much for tuning in to our first time. This is our first time ever hanging out, and we wanted you guys to know the raw, juicy content behind it. Juice! Guys, if you are still watching to this point, go comment the words, juice on the loose. That's what we've been saying. When Juice Boy goes crazy outside, we go, juice on the loose. Juice, juice on, on the loose. loose. 
it's so fun but we love you guys so much don't forget to like comment and subscribe and we'll see you in the next video peace